What is up, what is up, what is up, everybody? It is your boy, I'm back. And we are actually doing something different tonight. Um, I'm actually doing this for a friend of mine who is trying to get into doing um, production for instrumentals and shit. So I wanted to do something for him. And today I'm going to do the easiest method that I know how to start doing music on FL Studios. Just right off rip, having fun, and you know, doing my thing. But uh, with that being said, man, enough of the chit chat, enough of the shit chat. So, we are about to get this started, boy. So today I'm going to do something super simple. Some say it's cheating for making music, but it's actually not. It's literally another way to create very good music very quickly. Uh, thanks to a good buddy of mine by the name of Kyle Beats, who isn't necessarily a friend or a good buddy per se, but I do trust the guy on his music production skills. I've been watching this dude for quite a long time. Super, super nice guy. Very, very well-mannered guy. Super helpful when it comes to music production. Um, he's actually an award-winning music producer himself, so... Yeah. And he was the one that introduced me to these apps that are not apps, but these plugins that you can get for free that I use in my music all the time now. First off, we're going to start off with one of my personal favorites. That's wrong. We're going to start off personally with one of my personal favorite ones. This is one that I use if I have beat block or I'm stuck on something. I'll use this um, app right here. Like if I ever have, you know, beat block. It's called Unison Drum Monkey. It's by the same guys that do the Unison MIDI Core Pack, which... I do have the Unison Ultimate Bundle, which is super sick. Absolutely love Unison. If you've not tried them out, give them a shot, dude. They have a bunch of cool free shit. Give them a check out. I promise you guys, if you guys are like me and your producers, dude, I'm telling you, you will not regret it. I promise you that. No, I did not want that. That was loud. That is not the one we need. We're going to go down here to... Not this. Yeah. yeah. Alright. One sec, guys. I'll be right back. Y'all come on in. Hang on. Have a good time. I'll be right back, guys.
Bug rat. Get me. Bug rat, come here. Hey, shithead. Watch out, Sam. Sorry about that, you guys. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I had to chase down my dog. Sorry about that, guys. We are going to go to exclusive drones. Ooh, I like that hat. But first, we need to pick out a style. And for this one, I think we're going to do a trap. with four bars now let's hear how it sounds first nah. ooh that sounds nice Let's do that for the clothes hat. Uh, uh. Let's do eighty eight kicks. fucking heavy. We're going to shorten this up. We are going to shorten this 808 up here. Because that shit is just new. The noise profile. Okay, and apparently it doesn't want to work, so it's fine. We will just find another. Let's see how this sounds. Oh, that sounds sick. That actually sounds fucking good, dude.
Now we just need to find an. Oh, hold up. No, that's too rock. That's got like way too much bone to it. It's got too much. It's got too much heaviness to it. We want something that's super short. I like Kyle Beats. Don't get me wrong. By the way, shout out to Kyle Beats who hooked me up with everything that you guys see. Like, all the stuff that you guys see that I'm using right now was actually provided for free by uh, one of the producers that I look up to that's inspired me to start making beats again, which is Kyle Beats. So, shout out to Kyle Beats. And now let's add in a kick here. And now let's match up the kick. Let's put it right there, how? Goodbye, Tanner.
There we go. So now we got this. Alright, so now that we got our trap beat laid out. Try it all the way across. Alright, so now that we have our drum beat laid out, now we're going to look for melodies. Alright, so we're definitely going to need, like, something more melodic, which is where unison comes in. Alright, so what we're going to need is we are going to need one of my personal favorite things known as Arcade. So let's go in here, install generators, VST3, and then do Arcade. And you guys don't know, man, Arcade is one of my personal favorite go-tos, man. I use this all the fucking time. And for this one, I'm thinking maybe a piano might do it.
Alright, so I like how it drip sounds. That actually sounds really, really good. So what we're going to do is we're going to go down to unison. Yeah, no, I don't want to do glitch stuff. You know, I like glitch stuff. This shit's fun to me. You know, that shit is hella fun to me. That's not what we want. We want unison MIDI chords. So I'm thinking... Let's try borrowed and uh, model chords. Let's try E minor. Let's see how E minor sounds with arcade. Oh, perfect, dude. Oh, that is beautiful. So all we need to do now is go back and turn down this just a little tiny bit. And then also we need to bring the drum pad down a little bit. Alright, so now we need to use Arcade again in another pattern. Which means we're going to bust out Arcade again. We're going to go right here and we're going to use the same, we're going to do the same thing, but this time we're going to look for a counter melody to... with that same thing we're going to do the same thing as we did before bring the haze and the wet all the way up we're going to bring the haze and the wet up just a tad bit
Alright, that's perfect. Now all we need to do is go into unison, or back into unison, and we are going to add to it with Let's do triads. Oh, hold up. We got some stuff here. Alright, hold up. Let's try E major. Let's do triads. Let's do the first. E major. I need something that's like alternating. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to turn the I'm going to turn the volume down just a little bit Now I'm telling you right now if I see this up anywhere on YouTube I'm telling y'all right now, I'm giving everybody a heads up. If I see any of this up on YouTube, then y'all motherfuckers are getting hit with a fucking strike on your channel. No questions asked, no warnings, nothing. You guys will be smacked up with a fucking copyright strike, dude. I ain't fucking joking.
Now, if you want to play around and find out, then by all means, go ahead. Now, let's go in here into piano. piano picked out. Now let's go to notes and automation. Let's go all the way back to the very beginning here. sounding good so far so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna put this on track 4 
now we need to do add in a riser and we are good man holy shit this is sounding good got that classic EDM alright now let's go back into our stuff here and let's find a riser oh that'll actually work just need to chop off the very tail end that bring it all the way back to the beginning and reverse it now let's normalize it just to bring the noise up a bit and bam <laughs> Now what we're going to do is we're going to drag everything down to You know let's drag this down to 4 And I don't see if 4 is being used yet Alright but 1 is not being used Alright guys, if y'all can hear me, I am going to have to reset my stuff, so I'll catch you guys here in a bit. Peace.